Hey there, YouTube. And I want to wish all the vets, well, all the past vets, all the ones that have passed away, given their life to our country, all the ones that have come back and felt like they haven't been helped by our country and ended up taking their own life. Happy, you know, happy Memorial Day. <clears throat> We've kind of made this a uh, party type of a holiday when it should be more about mourning and reflecting on what was given to make our country what it was. Instead, it's about having time off of work, getting together, having barbecues, beginning of summertime, sales all over the place. Um, I didn't serve, unfortunately, I didn't, never signed up. I just, you know, but I'm grateful for the men and women that put their life on the line every day to make this the country that it is where we unfortunately have the right to throw fits over nonsensical things, believe in nonsensical things. So, about as far as I'm going to go with that. But, it's been a minute since I made a video. Um, I had COVID at one point in time. So, I took a break from smoking for a bit. Didn't do any of that, you know, about two weeks. Been wanting to do videos. It's been taking my time. Getting back into the rhythm of smoking, getting my tongue back normal. I had tetanitis that lasted for a few weeks. Um, so I just wanted to get back on track. Also on that time off. Get to that in a minute. I am smoking on today from Salt Lift Pipe Tobacco. They're it's not gonna pop up good. This lighting is the best. Their taste of summer. A taste of summer, delicious peaches with refreshing cream. Um, the tin note on this, see, I'm not really a big peaches guy. Like I can't eat the fruit peaches. I just, it's a texture thing. I can't do it. Um, I don't mind the flavors. One of my favorite beers actually has peaches in it. And it's, it's a Christmas beer from, now I'm drawing a blank. Um, shiner but the notes on this I, I don't they don't have on there what's on there there's definitely some virginias i feel like there might be some braille in this because i kind of get a little bit of braille and you get that light peach note with like a tiny bit of vanilla um it tastes delicious i can oh, I'll see if i can get you a good show of the tobacco it's ribbon cut Salt lift is known for being a little little wet, so you want to let this stuff dry out. Um, good 10 15 minutes. Salt lift, I don't know what they believe in caking the crap out of their blends. Um, you have C and D, who you get is dry, and salt lift is just like throw that all on there, it'd be all right. Um, We have a bad case of gypsy moths this year, and they're biting like crazy. It's just, they're all over the place. Um, the taste is smooth. With the topping, whatever they put the peach on there, definitely comes through. You get that kind of light, creamy vanilla, and you get that you definitely get some Virginia in there. You get that sweet Virginia leaf. I, I want to say there's burley in here. I, I don't take my word for it. I should have looked before I looked at it or before I did this video. Um, it's not a bad blend. And I can tell you the room nut on it is fantastic. It's just that peaches and cream mixed together. It smells delicious. It's just a good blend. Um, it, is, it is hot today. It's got to be high 80s, maybe 90s, sweating all day. Also, my time off, we decided to take a leap and start raising chickens. Um, seems to be like the big thing to do right now. Everybody wants to raise chickens up. And I don't blame them. With the price of everything going up, eggs have gone up, milk's going up. So, started out small with four chicks. Um, we were given a coop, thankfully. We didn't have to pay for it. It was, it was given to us. 
and then they also gave us a hen so we're getting a couple eggs from her about once a day well started off good we got two days in a row out of her and then something punched through the coop and took two of our chicks so we had five total um someone took two of our chicks and i got looking at it and i can't play like i said it was it was a free coop we didn't pay anything for it but you can see where some of the staples and stuff that's holding the fencing in on the coop is coming out and it's easily penetrable so i reinforced i put new cage up and then i put a predator apron around the bottom so nothing should be able to dig into it now um the hen's back to laying again, thankfully, so I think she was spooked from whenever grabbed them. Um, we did have something punch in another side before I was able to get it all totally done. But it's completely reinforced now, predator aprons down. So we're at th three chickens now. The one hen that we call mother hen because the people that gave us gave her to us. I said that she had stopped laying, but was a good mother hen, so we just called her mother hen. Um, but my species comfortable enough here, she's laying. And then we have two others. Um, told our daughters not to not to name them because we do plan on eating them. Once they stop laying, I am smoking my Lord Excellence. French briar that I got from RNA Treasures. Decent little smoke of a pipe. Uh, so it's not much, you know, doing the chicken thing now and get back into the flow of things. Smoking on some Taste of Summer from Salt Left Peaches and Cream flavored. Uh, that's all I got today folks it's a quick video I'm getting back into the swing of things got to get used to talking to the camera again well thank you for watching until next time folks happy smokes